Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976. Allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarship, and research. Fair use is used to permit a copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing uh, nonprofit educational or personal use tips to balance in favor of fair use. So let's go ahead and cook. Let's go ahead and cook. This is your New York Nick fan from Nashville. This is your boy Musa doing what it do. So please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. What about them Knicks, though? What about them Knicks, though? Yes, you know, they, they did their thing to Orlando, and Orlando came and humbled them, too. Yes, we had to take that smoke when smoke is given. But they rebounced back, and they beat a, a strong Philadelphia team without Ben Simmons. I understand that. But they still ended a 15-game winning streak towards the Philadelphia 76ers. But my beloved New York Knicks winning this game. Matter of fact, let me go down and uh, scores of the NBA. We only had uh, four games, actually five games. So let's go ahead and cook. The Warriors over the Thunder winning 106 to 98. Golden State uh, coach Steve Kerr playing uh, to get Stephen Curry some extra rest. Didn't quite turn out how he helped, you know what I'm saying? But Golden State is undefeated. They 4-0, baby. They 4-0. Rockets and the Mavericks, and the Mavericks come away winning this 116-106. to 106. Luka Doncic had 26 points, 14 boards. Reggie Bullock had his best game with his new team by scoring 16 points. And the Dallas Mavericks beat the Houston Rockets once again, 116-106. to 106. Lakers and the Spurs, and these Los Angeles Lakers. Oh, my God, they played each game with so much emphasis and so much drama. But they went in overtime. They went to overtime. You mean they, the Lakers got all the people they got and they went to overtime? And they struggled against uh, 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 Memphis the other night? But anyway, Davis had 35 points, 17 boards. Russell Westbrook had 33 points, 10 boards, and the Los Angeles Lakers rallied without so-called King LeBron James, beating the San Antonio Spurs 125 to 121. Nuggets and the Jazz. Nuggets and the Jazz. And Utah come away with this one. 122 to 110. Without injured Nikola Jokic. Oh, the Jokers hurt? Rudy Gobert gladly took center stage down the stretch. And Utah once again executed. Winning 122 to 110. Now my beloved New York Knicks. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Beating the Philadelphia 76ers. 112 to 99. Once again, 112 to 99. Well, Kimber Walker in the Air 48, the Knicks can do things they couldn't last season. Hell yeah, I concur. I am in full of agreements. I mean, with Reggie Bullock, they just had somebody to stay in the background and shoot threes. With Evan Fournier and um, Kimber Walker, at least with Kimber Walker, you can have somebody to break down the defense and run and execute the pick and roll and get the distributor ball. Even with Evan Fournier, I believe he can run the pick and roll a little bit, and he can pass the ball, and he's a good shooter, especially when he has space. So, you know, when you implement, uh, you implement good spacing uh, with good shooting, you can win. You can win any type of game you want, half court, uh, uh, run and gun. And with the centerpiece, Mitchell Robinson coming off the uh, – did, did he come off the bench? I don't know, but let's go to the score box right quick. The high man was 19 points for Kimball Walker. The high man for uh, Philly was Tobias Harris. Are you kidding me? Joel Embiid only had 14 points? Are you kidding me? The African Nightmare only had 14 points? He played like trash juice. And they only had 13 points coming off the, off the bench. Now for the Knicks, hell, Randall only scored 16, but he had 11 boards and 7 assists. Almost had a triple-double. Kimber Walker had 19, 3, and 5. Uh, Eric Fournier, 18, 2, and 4. RJ, come on, baby. We got to get it together, man. He only had 10 points, but he shot 4 for 10. But is he asked to do so much? We just asked to win. We are just asking people to win. We're not asking people to become superstars and nothing like that. I'm just so happy for Tibbs uh, implementing his style and his play with the New York Knicks. Uh, 
walking the ball up, uh, having a point guard that knows his role, get everybody else involved. Everybody got the concept of man-on-man defense. And if they ingest this mythology and ingest um, uh, uh, the fundamentals to practice and execute and just have the fire and desire and the will to be better than it was yesterday, I I don't see why the Knicks can't win the championship. I know people are like, what the hell are you talking about? Man, they got two starting lineups. <laughs> two starting lineups. Definitely, I don't see why they can't make the Eastern Conference. <laughs> Oh, you just a delusional Knicks fan. That's, I know. I know that's what you're saying. I know that's what you're saying. But hey, competition. That I, they might have competition. Well, you're supposed to have competition in practice. But whatever's going on in practice right now is translating up on the court right now at game time. And that, as a fan, that's what I'm appreciative of. I, I can also recall being a Knicks fan. I was trying to uh, uh, incorporate a certain piece. Uh, free agent uh, going in a hole, giving up draft picks and all that. It's not worth it. I love the uh, the organic, uh, the organic way how we're building up a team. So Knicks fans, uh, leave me some comments. Let me know what you think, man. And uh, like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Peace.